Security checkpoints characterized by roadblocks across the country is common sight. These checkpoints are occasioned by security challenges facing the country. However, there have been reports of some of these roadblocks being illegal. The House of Representatives at Plenary Wednesday moved against such illegal roadblocks across the country. According to the mover of the motion, Representative Ifaim Moma, the illegal roadblocks along Onicha Oweri Expressway has caused the death of people in recent times. On Saturday, the 13th day of May 2020, the police makeshift road blockage was the cause of a fatal accident at Ijiala, which led to the death of the trailer driver and his conductor, as well as over 10 bus passengers. I think we must caution them to be careful of the way they discharge their constitutional responsibility not to stampede the rights of the citizens of those communities as the motion moved by rightly put. Or the policemen stationed at that particular time if there are illegal checkpoints there. But it's good, like you have said, they should commission an investigation to find out are uh, these policemen there stationed there, legally stationed there? The house uh, should mandate the Inspector General for Police to ensure the removal of illegal checkpoints across the country. Speaking to newsmen after plenary, the lawmakers said the roadblocks have caused untold hardship on the people plying the road. The most annoying part of it is that it could have been avoidable. It could have been avoidable. What cost it? Very simple. There was a police checkpoint at the end of a slope in between two petrol stations. I've never seen where you mount a police checkpoint that will be engulfed in the middle of two petrol stations. Charity Tanko, ITV News, Abuja.